Hello out there, it's breakfast time again, and you know what that means. Going out to the store and finding a nice good cereal to eat full of vitamins and nutrients and... Well, no, sometimes what you find is a movie tie-in or a, something that is based on toys. Well, that's what we got this time. Or is that a game? I guess it's a game and toys. It's everything. It's Pokemon. Gotta catch them all. Well, I caught a box of Pokemon. <laughs> They're coming out with the silliest things these days. Look at this. On the back, you can even do a puzzle thingy or whatever. What? But we're not here to do puzzles. We want to check out Pokemon cereal for ourselves, right? Is this stuff any good? Only one way to find out. We must test it. So, out comes the famous bowl with the famous spoon. Ding. And let's check this out, okay? Oh, I happen to notice on the top of the box. Get in here. That uh, you can clip that out for something, but you don't have to clip it out anymore. It's scannable, so you need an app. What is it with apps these days? I don't know. Everything is based on your cell phone, right? Oh my gosh, look at these things. Oh, yikes. Whoa. Look, 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 look. Oh my God, it's Technicolor. Oh, wow. And yes, you can't have cereal without marshmallows. No siree. <laughs> What are these things? I don't know. <laughs> if that's supposed to be in the shape of something, I don't know what that is. What is that? <laughs> what is that? Okay, so, oh, there's another one. It's a pink one. <laughs> I don't know. Who thinks up these things? Well, anyway. Bag of Canadian milk. Doused thoroughly with cow juice. Mmm, doesn't that look good? What the? <laughs> Guys, what? Berry Bolt flavor. <laughs> supposed to taste like berries. I, I guess these are supposed to be blueberries. Maybe these things are strawberries. I don't know. Marshmallows. Got no clue. So, I don't know how this is based on Pokemon toys or whatever, but... Let's try it out, okay? Okay. All right. Our first spoon on the full. Hmm. Well, you know what? They don't taste bad. They do taste kind of fruity. But they turn gummy. What's with the gummy stuff? You know, like they're stuck in between my molars. What the heck? Uh. Ah! Oh, this stuff is a dentist's dream. Kids everywhere are going to be eating this stuff and it'll be stuck in their teeth and causing... All kinds of cavities and, oh no, I'm afraid this is dangerous. Hmm. But being that it's a tie-in, these things never last on the shelf long. You know, like, whatever the flavor of the month is, like, oh, I don't know, Spider-Man or something, there'll be a Spider-Man cereal. So, Pokemon cereal, I don't know, what took you so long? Haven't these things been around for, like, 20, 25 years? And they're just coming up with it now? Say, we haven't made a cereal about Pokemon yet. Well, there she be. There she be. And I've tried it. Yeah, it tastes fruity. Yeah, well, who makes this stuff? General Mills. So really, what? You know what? These things are kicks. You know, you know, kicks. Berry flavored kicks. And don't they already make berry berry kicks? Repurposed. 
Nothing new here. Take an old cereal and slap a new name on it. Yeah, right. So if you like Berry Berry Kicks, you ought to like Pokemon. Look, it's the family size, so you can feed your whole family of relatives and everything when Uncle Fred comes over and he says, Hey man, you want some Pokemon? Yes! Yeah, there's, there's not even anything in there. You can't even reach in and get a prize. What? Toy-based cereal with no prizes? What kind of devilish idea is that? Well, try it if you must. I imagine it'll revert back to Berry Berry Kicks after the Pokemon kick has ended. So, eh. Big whoop. Goodbye now. Enjoy your breakfast.